Hello, Junior Guides. I am Safari Guide Frank. I hope you are as excited as I am about today's safari. Can you guess what we will be seeing today? Today we will be exploring the fascinating world of reptiles. Reptiles are some of the most fascinating creatures on the planet, and they have been around for more than 350 million years. There are almost 6,550 species on the planet, of which 480 species occur in southern Africa. The living reptiles are divided into four groups, of which three occur in southern Africa. The four groups are testudines, which is turtles, tortoises, and terrapins, squamata, which is snakes and lizards, crocodilia, which is crocodiles and alligators, and then rhynchocephalia, which is the tuatara, only found in New Zealand. So what is a reptile? The most prominent feature is their dry, hairless skin that is modified into scales. They have bones in their bodies and most lay eggs to reproduce. They are ectothermic or cold-blooded. This does not mean that their bodies are cold. It means that they get their body heat from an external source usually the sun. Before we go any further, we need to know the difference between poison and venom. Poison is something that causes harm when ingested, that is swallowed. Venom, on the other hand, is a poisonous substance that needs to be injected. Snakes, spiders, scorpions and some insects have fangs and stingers that work like an injection. Venom is therefore injected into their prey to immobilize them, or in self-defense should they feel threatened. Let's discuss lizards. Lizards are commonly found on land and can range from the smallest geckos to the largest Komodo dragons. There are about 230 species of lizard in southern Africa. Their diet ranges from insects to small mammals. Snakes. Snakes are found in all habitats in Africa. Snakes are legless and lack external ears. All snakes are carnivores. There are about 143 species of snakes in southern Africa. Their diet ranges from insects, frogs, fish to medium-sized animals. Snakes can see very well. They cannot hear any airborne sounds and they smell with their tongue. Snakes can eat very large prey. They can dislocate their jaw in order to swallow it. Snakes can be very dangerous. They have teeth that can cause serious pain and inject venom to immobilize their prey. Snakes are roughly classified into four groups according to their tooth structure. The four groups are solid-toothed snakes, back-fanged snakes, fixed-front-fanged snakes, and hinged-front-fanged snakes. The black mamba. The black mamba is possibly the most feared snake in Africa. It has a reputation to be very unpredictable. They are also the longest venomous snakes in Africa and have a neurotoxic venom that paralyzes their prey almost instantly. The African Rock Python The African Rock Python is the longest non-venomous snake in Africa. It constricts its prey by curling around it and then swallowing it. It is famous for even swallowing some antelope species. The Puff Adder The Puff Adder is the most widely distributed snake in Africa. It is also responsible for most of the serious snake bite incidents yearly. The puff adder got its name from the sound it makes when threatened. It makes a hissing sound. They have hinged fangs and cytotoxic venom that immobilizes its prey. They are very well camouflaged. The boom slung. 
The Boomslang is one of the most beautiful snakes and is very active. They live mostly in trees, hence the Afrikaans name Boomslang. Boom, which means tree, and slang, which means snake. They specialize in catching chameleons. They have back fangs and inject a hemotoxic venom that they use to paralyze their prey. Turtles, terrapins, and tortoises. These three species live on land and in water. All of them need to lay their eggs on land. They eat a variety of food. In general, they are quite slow. Remember the story about the hare and the tortoise? Turtles. Turtles live mostly in the sea. They are known for living very long and can reach a ripe old age of up to 100 years. Some turtles are vegetarian, while others eat crustaceans like lobsters and crabs. They need to come onto land to lay their eggs. Turtles have modified legs that are known as flippers, which they use to swim. Terrapins. Terrapins live mostly in fresh water. They are omnivores. Do you perhaps know what an omnivore is? An omnivore is an animal that has the ability to eat and survive on both plant and animal matter. They sunbake on branches, rocks, and even on hippos to regulate their body temperature. Tortoises. Tortoises live on land. They can also live for quite long well over 40 years. The most common tortoise that we find in southern Africa is known as the leopard tortoise. Tortoises are vegetarian. This is the end of the module. Now that you have learned more about reptiles, we're going to test your knowledge with a quiz. We look forward to our next adventure together.